Assalamu alaikum, I am Sakir Abbas and today I am going to talk about universal asynchronous receiver and transmitter. This is a protocol. UART is a commonly known and used protocol in this communication setup. Two individual UART setups communicate with each other either by becoming a receiver or a transmitter. Both can act as a transmitter or a receiver. It works like a CPU with transmit data serial, serially to the receiving UART. For example, in this uh, UART, we can understand UART as uh, the microcontroller or CPU sends data to a UART transmitter parallelly. And the UART transmitter takes it, takes the data parallelly and arranges it accordingly in a serial format. Then attach a starting bit, start bit, and a stop bit at the end and uh, at the start and uh, end at the end of the data that is being transmitted. And after it has attached the start and the stop bit, it transmits the data serially to the another UART receiver and which takes the data and removes start and stop bit from it and then <clears throat> sends the data to to further stage or any microcontroller or CPU present on the other end. Uh, this you can see is the code which is implemented uh, in Verilog. Uh, this is a this basically is a UR transmitter receiver setup and with its test bench as well. The first one you are seeing is that is the transmitter designed for this purpose. In this file, you can see there are some. Uh, lines of code written but the main thing to understand is these four states state idle state start state data and state stop state idle is when we we are neither sending data from uh, the from the transmitter state start is when we have when we start at the start bit to the data we we are going to transmit the state state data represents the attachment of data with the start bit and uh, state stop uh, represents the end uh, attachment of the end bit uh, and then transmitting it serially to the uh, receiver. Uh, on the other end, the receiver module contains the three state which is uh, uh, removing uh, first receiving the whole data and then removing uh, the start and stop bit and uh, excluding the data from the overall transmitted data that has been received by the receiver. So first it will take the data and then it will remove the start bit and then it separates the data and because it's uh, after removing the start bit, it starts counting the bits and when it reaches the uh, stop bit, it, it will remove the stop bit and then for further transmit the uh, separated data from the uh, from the received data and further will send to or communicate it to uh, a receiver or microcontroller. This is the top module which includes both uh, the transmitter receiver and board generator and uh, we can simulate it and see for ourselves what are the results. This is the result of our simulation. We have transmitted 00, 0 and received 00. 0. We have transmitted 01 and received 01 and so on. Thank you.